What is up, guys? Here we are. This is another episode here with Patrick. Call me High Grade Pat. We got another episode here of opening up some PSA submissions. Um, I got a few submissions back. Uh, multiple cards on each submission that are, uh, you know, to me, kind of high end, but, you know, not the highest of high. But um, we got some Luka Doncic's. We got some Michael Jordan's. Got a couple Zions. Um, and this this first piece right here I want to show you is going to be the submission of about six cards here. And then we have another group of cards that I'm going to show in another video. With uh, with me and my brother, we submitted a lot, bunch of cards. And uh, this one was just kind of a, a more recent submission that... Um, that I got with some uh, some so stuff out of a select box, and then uh, a couple other things that I picked up along the way. So, uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and just get into this, okay? And I haven't looked at the, the grades yet. Not, uh, this is again, this is the second time I've done this, and I haven't looked at the grades. I don't know what's going to happen. Well, I mean, we, we're going to see some cards, right? But. I don't know what grades we're gonna have. I mean, uh, so this first one here, it's a Michael Jordan, and <laughs> we'll see what this is gonna be. Um, I got a feeling that it's not gonna be the greatest grade, but I just couldn't help myself from submitting. Um, the backside had a little bit of a kind of a surface issue, a little bit, but you know, it's kind of almost like why not? I mean, let's just submit it. So this was the. 97 metal, a FLIR metal, uh, I can't remember the exact thing, but we'll, we'll turn it around and we'll see. But I'm going to cover the grade up, actually. Not look at it. Let's see if we can... Okay, Metal Universe, right? So this card became pretty hot recently. I'll admit that I paid a little bit above what I could have paid if I had just waited a little bit for the market to cool down, but... It is what it is. I thought it was, it looked sharp. I thought this would be worthy of grading. So let's just see. Ah, oh, okay. You know, I thought that that might happen. You know, I thought that it, I was thinking maybe an eight or nine. And uh, a seven, you know, that's kind of what I expected from that. Um, the corners were not the greatest. They weren't bad though. I thought that that was good enough to maybe get an eight or nine. But, all right, uh, so we'll take a seven. All right, moving on to the next one. So this was, uh, let's see. Yeah, 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 okay. So one of these was the premium box set that I got from a trade with a buddy of mine, with a good friend of mine, the, uh, the Luca. Uh, this is from the 2018 Optic premium box set. Um, we'll see... You know, I, I got a feeling that the centering might have got me here. And, you know, you see that there's a little bit of a gap there at the bottom and the right as well. So besides that, though, I thought it was good. And I, it was an, an, honestly, this was kind of a test run to see if you could get a 10 on what I thought was a pretty, really, like a really good sh sharp card, great surface. Uh, and then it's an 8. Well, okay, that's fine. That's fine. Um, this this is why I put this at the start, because I didn't think that these were going to be the greatest, honestly. Um, I thought at least a 9, but, uh, you know, an 8 is an 8, right? <laughs> okay, so, all right, so we got a LeBron James here. Optic Hollow. Um, these have been very hot recently, and I don't want to see the grade yet. Again, the centering was not the greatest, but I got this out of my own box. I got it out of a box, and I was like, you know what? Let's just send it in. I'm the only one that's touched it, and I thought, why not? Let's just let's go for it and see what it gets, and it gets an 8. Yeah. 
Well, um, not the best turnout so far. Um, <laughs> you know, I guess that's a, a learning experience, right? That's what we can do from this. We can take it as a learning experience and don't submit things that are not off-center, for one. And don't just hope and pray to the gods that they're just going to give you a 10 or a 9. But, you know, it, it's fine. It, it is what it is, and I'm more than welcome to, to sell or trade that card or even keep it. I mean, that's – even though I don't really collect LeBron, uh, um, my brother does. Um, so we'll see what, we, what we'll do with that. Okay, so this is uh, Luca, and – the red eyes. <clears throat> Sitting was really good. Um, I got a feeling that the only thing that could have ding dinged to it was maybe a little bit of surface. But I thought it was very sharp and clean. And that's what we get. All right. We'll take a 10 on this. Um, again, you know, this is what I thought was probably one of the highest possibilities of getting a 10. Um you know these other cards. You know, especially these two, Luca, this Luca and the, Le the LeBron. Uh, I thought they'd get a nine because I, you know, a lot of times PSA doesn't seem to be as hardcore on centering. Here we get it over there. All right, but yeah, those optics are tough, man. They they are. But hey, man, this is this is very sweet, very sweet. I'm happy with this. But these next two are very interesting, so I saved these for last, especially the last one. Uh, it's it's huge, huge card. Um, I got the both of these cards out of the same box, uh, believe it or not. So, um, <clears throat> without further ado, uh, let's go ahead and put the first one here. They looked. I'll just say that they looked great. The surf, the if surface. Corners, edging, all that stuff. It looked looked great. Um, this one may not have been the greatest centering, but I don't. I mean, I don't know if you get an advantage if you submit earlier than others. Because I've, you know, this was select, and um, I opened this probably back in March. I want to say I can't remember. Early March or late February. And the, uh, you know, the pandemic started, so the PSA didn't really allow submissions. So a couple weeks or two or three weeks after I opened this, I was planning on submitting. And then at, right at that point, they basically shut down their offices. So I got a feeling these, these are low population, especially the next one that I got. Uh, this is the tricolor Zion Premier. Um, so enough talking. Let's just see what it is. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the reveal again. No looky. No looky. Okay. Beautiful card. I I kind of, you know, I missed the red yellow tricolor of select. But this looks really cool too, especially with Zion's colors. Kind of goes with the uh, the Pelicans jerseys. Ah, okay. It's a nine, and uh, you know I think it's probably because of the centering. If you see. The left side's a lot, seems to have more just all happening on that side than the right. If you can, you can kind of see like the, the semicircles a little bit, it's filled out more than this side. That's how I can kind of see that. But, you know, you got to take your shots. Um, not a 10, but, the, you know, that's okay. That's fine. Uh, this is still a badass card. But uh, let's go on with the last one. The big boy. Could not believe that I got this card. Could not believe it. Uh, especially whenever I got this other one, too, in the same box. It's a tie-dye. Number 25, if you're not aware, of the concourse. Yeah, the, so it's like the base, the first level, which I think these look better than the Premier. So personally, I think this is a about a suite of a hit you can get. Obviously, there's better, 
but this is very top notch, top notch hit. I couldn't believe it. Uh, I went crazy. Um, I, I would, I'm going to be honest if it, I'm going to try to hold my emotions. Okay. We're going to try our best here. Um, I would be surprised if it's not a 10. Um, I've had my hopes up to, for it to be a 10. I mean, who wouldn't, right? But just looking at it, and I really looked close, and you know, I, I, I have my own setup to where I, I have magnifying, a big magnifying glass with lighting and whatnot. So I, I take a look at my cards. Uh, well, man, you got some eights over there. Really, you know, not like looking too good there. Well, I got gotcha. you. I understand. Sometimes you just submit because you're just like, ah, maybe it'll maybe it'll pass the grade. I mean, if it doesn't, it doesn't. This one, in my heart, I really feel like I feel like it's a ten. Let's look. It's a ten. It happened. All right, guys. So look at this card, guys. My God. And I just personally, my one of my favorite parallels of select is the tie-dye, like all the different tie-dyes that are out there. I just love the it pops. It's kind of hard in the, the lighting that I'm doing this in, but it's, you know, it doesn't really pop as much with the, the lighting in this. That's kind of sweet. Kind of gets it. But yeah, I mean, whew. all right, this, you know, I, I got it some eights and some nines. This makes up for it. I don't care. This was the, this was the big boy anyway. Um, <clears throat> not like those not that those other cards are not good. They're they're nice cards, obviously. Um but man, this this was uh <sighs> all right. That feels good. That feels good. Try not to get too high, not try not to get too low with this kind of stuff, but uh, you know, it's tough whenever there's hundreds, if not thousands of dollars at times with, with some of these cards. So yeah, the uh the adrenaline starts flowing and uh you know you the anticipation's there, so I'm just real happy that this came in as a 10. Um, so I really appreciate that. I think we're going to end it there. It's been about 12 minutes. Uh, I'm going to I'm gonna go ahead and call it there. So what a card. What a break there. Um, we didn't get the greatest results in the world. But that's okay. The big boy came back at 10. So we're going to add him to our Luca And our nice little Jordan here. I got a nice little collection going. All the greatest ever what I think could be potentially one of the greatest down the line uh, we'll see of course uh, and then this guy you know sky's the limit but hey who knows what's gonna happen with Zion um, that's gonna do it hey I really appreciate it um, if you've stayed this long go ahead if you just started watching at this beginning and you fast forward to the end hit a like hit a subscribe I, and uh, I really appreciate it, it help me grow the channel all right man take it easy thanks